There's a bunch of new content coming to Animal Crossing over the next few weeks, so let's break down all you need to know. First, the island is getting some new visitors. Leaf the Sloth will start appearing in your plaza, and he sells seeds for flowers and shrubs, which are being added to New Horizons. Meanwhile, Jolly Red will dock his boat at your private beach, and you can talk to him to purchase furniture and works of art. You can donate legit artwork you purchase to the museum's new art wing, too. Leaf, Red, and the art wing are being added via a free update on April 23rd, which is also when Nature Day kicks off. As you might expect, the event involves a lot of flowers, trees, and the new shrubs. There will be special Nook Miles Plus objectives for tending to these while the event runs, until May 4th. Those dates actually overlap with another event, May Day. That will run from May 1st through the 7th, during which time you'll be able to visit special islands that are separate from the Nook Miles Mystery Tours. One of these has a hedge maze, and you can spot fan-favorite Rover among the bushes. May has yet another Animal Crossing event on the horizon. International Museum Day will run from the 18th through the end of the month, during which time you'll fill out a stamp card with the fish, insects, and fossils you've collected. There's some sort of special reward for collecting these stamps. <laughs> then the wedding season event will run for the whole month of June. Visit Harv's Island and you'll encounter the alpaca couple Reese and Cyrus. You'll be able to take special anniversary photos and earn wedding-themed rewards for doing so. New Horizons is getting really busy with all this stuff, so be sure to stay tuned to GameSpot for all the info on future Animal Crossing updates.